tomorrow. Yes. Today we are going on a day trip mm -hmm. to Otaru. And that's like an hour away, I think, right? Yeah. We had a train there. But for now, we are walking through the snow and heading to the metro. Which is conveniently right here. So we're not actually taking the metro. Yeah, we're just walking underground so we don't have to be outside. Yeah, you actually have to take the JR train from Sapporo to Otaru. That's where we're headed. Alright, so we tried those machines. They didn't have it, so we're gonna try these ones. tickets that were non-reserved, meaning we don't actually have a seat. Yeah, we might be standing, we might be sitting, we don't know. Nice seat you got there. Thank you. I'm leaning. Non-reserved. <laughs> hey, it was cheaper though. Yes, it was. Swanson, how's your hoodie and rain jacket doing as a jacket, you know? Gets the job done. Does it? with a star on it. It's a rabbit and other small snowmen. And there's seals. Oh, Otaru is known for their seafood. So we're gonna go try something called a dochen brewery. Dirt. It's like basically a bowl. And this one specifically has like fresh seafood in it mm -hmm. from this region. Yes, Brianna is going to go try that. This is more touristy than we expected. Yeah. Ooh, snow sculpture. So cute. I'm looking forward to walking around though. Yeah. There's a bunch of glass shops and all sorts of cool stuff. Cataro. So the restaurant we're mapping to is this way. Alright, maybe it's up and around. Found it. Huh. Okay, we're gonna tell us things. Alright, so the last restaurant we tried to eat at, there was no vacancy. So we went next door, and it looks pretty good. Yeah, same building. We're in like an attached building. He got fried chicken, and I got a sashimi. It has a lot of interesting things. It has Amberjack, tuna, scallops, salmon, sweet shrimp, flying fish, roe, squid, and omelette. You excited? I am. Um, that's an expensive price, but I'm excited. I'm excited for the fried chicken and rice. It's kind of small. And you got your chicken. I got some chicken and rice. This is it. I don't know what it's one. I also don't know how to eat them. Oh, yeah. Go for it. Oh, that's not bad. That's pretty good. Okay. I like the eggs. Now, this is what I don't know how to eat. Do you just eat the. It's cold. It's cold? Yeah. Where do you put the head? Okay, Do you want the small dish? Okay. Yeah, this looks more like regular shrimp. How is it? That's incredibly good. I like melting your mouth. It's kind of weird. It's kind of weird, but it's good. It's good fried chicken. There's a lot here. This is way more chicken than I thought I was getting. So. 
I've got, I've got a lot of work ahead of me. All right, so we finished our food. Mm -hmm. Mine was palatable. I thought it was pretty good. It was definitely different. I'm not used to that raw of seafood in such a mass quantity. It was good though. It was a good place to try it, I think. Brianna shuffling. Every day I'm shuffling. <laughs> are a little bit melty, but uh, looking pretty good for a frog king. Hey, we managed to make it here with only falling once. Yeah. <laughs> they gave us free little cookies. <laughs> famous ice cream made with their milk and currently it has a hint of a type of cheese flavor as a secret ingredient. They're very good. All right, Brianna's gonna do a better description than me. I'm not. You like it? It's cold. Oh wow. There is quite a um, dairy. Very, it tastes like milk. Which sounds weird because it's ice cream. But like, not all ice cream tastes a lot like milk. This tastes a lot like milk. Mm -hmm. Very rich. Kind of stupid move considering how cold it is outside. Mm. For over $10, you can try a slice of melon. To be fair though, it's supposed to be some of the best melon in the world. Just not today. <laughs> I wanted to get a video of you walking through the snow. Everyone is slipping, it's great. People have been slipping all day. How is he not frozen? Kind of like those flamingos in Bolivia. They're so cute. How are they not frozen? Goodness, okay. Wait, is this a canal? No. No. Oh. Hi Kurt, we saw the canal. Yeah, it's really cold. It's super icy. There's like so many tourists here. I it don't is understand funny. why, but it's cool. Yeah, I think we're gonna head back to Sapporo now. Very slippery. We might take a cab to the subway station. <laughs> Nothing. Ooh. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Oh, okay. There's literally so many people just to see that view. That's so funny. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Back at the station. <sighs> no more standing. Dinner. So the train ride back from Uroro to Sapporo was very easy. Mm -hmm. And this time we even had seats. Yeah, which was nice. Um, right now we are in the underground area and we are getting some of the special ramen Yes. that's known in the area. So Hokkaido is known for their dairy, their corn, their seafood, and, and one their of melon. And their melon, yes. One of the special, like every region you go to in Japan has like kind of a different ramen that they're popular for. So here they have corn and butter, or buttered corn, that is in their miso ramen. Mm -hmm. Corn is a thing up here. Very much so. Like Hello Kitty ha wears a hat of corn here. They have Snoopy with corn keychains. <laughs> Look at this beautifulness. This giant slab of butter on here. Look at this thing. <laughs> nuts. All right, please try it. I feel like I gotta mix it all up, right? Throw a little bit of corn in there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It smells delicious. Mm. Isn't that good? That is delicious. 
a little bit spicier than the miso I'm used to, but that's delicious. All right, Brianna, so uh, what would you think of the ramen? That was delicious. I wasn't even hungry. We were both talking about how in extreme weather, whether it's cold or hot, we're not hungry most of the time. So we weren't going to get dinner. We were going to get dinner. We were going to get like a Lawson snack. That was delicious. Kurt really wasn't hungry though. I wasn't hungry and I powered through. Kurt though, listened to his body. Are you sure? I don't know if I should. Sure. This is called self control. This is called I liked the taste. Oh, that's cool. So today was a good day. Yes, we got back to Sapporo. We had some good ramen. Mm -hmm. And now we are heading back to the room. It's dark, it's cold. The underground here is like miles long. Cool. You literally could have a vacation of just trying to explore it. Yeah. Anyway, it's been good and tomorrow we explore more of Sapporo. Yes. And then we head back to Tokyo. It's on another overnight ferry. Mm -hmm. That is actually very cool. Anyway. Right. Yeah, don't put your hands in the chain link pants. Because if you slip it could deglove them. Or an extra pair of gloves. Brianna, those are socks. Yeah. Gotta do what you gotta do. Mm-hmm. It's a Kodo Paxi. Another Kodo Paxi. That one's cute. That's a KFC bucket. Because there's a KFC. 